could be anywhere in the world tonight, what brings you to the United Nations Foundation dinner in New York City? This is the place where we draw on the support of multiple communities, not just the diplomatic community we work with every day, but business, civil society, individuals from around the United States that want to support the UN. Hearing Jane Fonda say how firmly and passionately she supports the UN, someone at our table said it's wonderful to hear that with an American accent. Well, I've worked with um, well, the UN and UNICEF and um, on a lot of things, but more than anything I've been involved with Girl Rising and um, they made this incredible movie um, and I was a part of that um, and I told her a really great story about this girl called Ruxana from India and um, so I'm really here to basically be presenting being a champion of, of Girl Up and women all around the world and um, it's a cause that I feel really, really um, close to my heart and it's something that I've worked for, for a really long time so where better to do it than the United Nations? Well, for one, support for, you know, an institution and a team that is incredible and has given such a lot of effort and commitment to the work that we're doing on the post-2015. Right from the very beginning, um, I started just over a year ago. Um, and I think the enthusiasm and, and the opportunities and the positive nature of it all is, you know, I have to be here. It's, it's, uh, it's something that we want to continue doing and strengthening and um, they're going to be with us all the way to 2015. So I'm here for that. As a board member, I take this as a great opportunity for the UN Foundation first and also for all those uh, marvelous jobs the United Nations has been doing since the end of Second World War. We need peace. We need development. With all these kind of a noble goals there, I think we are now just uh, facing lots of opportunities for people around working together instead of all those fightings, killings, that's sad.